Hey guys, Mr. Shrum here. Um, just wanted to give you a little quick tutorial, kind of a walkthrough on how to log into College Board. Um, this is really important, especially coming up for the AP exam. If you cannot log into College Board and check um, AP Classroom, then there's no way that you can take the AP exam, even if you've signed up. So you have got to make sure that you can log in to AP Classroom through collegeboard.org. Okay, so I'm gonna walk you through what this looks like college board okay so whenever you get to collegeboard.org it's got a lot of information a lot of good links stuff that i put in google classroom uh, like the youtube live classes um, and other information that you would need uh, staying up to date so you can get that right there but what you need to do is look at the sign in over here Click that, make sure when you click on that, um, you put a username and your password. Now your username is not going to be your email that you signed in with. It's gonna be a different username. I told pretty much all my classes to pick a username that you could remember. I opted to encourage everyone to use their school email username as something that would kind of be easy to fall back on and also picking a very similar password um, or some sort of arrangement like that. So you have got to make sure that all of this stuff works, that you can sign into College Board before the test date. Now, if you're having any trouble or anything like that, I'll help you as much as I can. Um, but if you otherwise just forgot your username or password, just remember to um, click on this it would probably default to your school email if that's what you signed in with. If it didn't go to your school email, then it probably went to whatever personal email address that you registered with. But like I said, I encouraged almost everyone to put the school email just because it's kind of an easy thing to remember. So whenever you submit, we take you to a page over like here and on this page, you would look up towards the top left where you have like this little drop down carrot. We're looking for AP Central. Okay, so that's going to be like the third option under AP. Now, what you would do is scroll down to AP Classroom. And it should take you to whatever landing page your class is in, okay? So whenever you get to those pages, it should have like a series of like, oh, you could take a unit three FRQ. And this would be good practice. Um, this is another tool for you guys to use, especially like while we're out of the classroom. Um, so I've opened up all of them for you guys to work on. And if you're not working on the FRQs right now, uh, I would highly encourage you to do so because the exam is only gonna be FRQs. Okay, so I'm trying to get as much feedback as I can while we're away from class. Uh, just continue to work on those and make sure that you can sign into College Board. Okay, if you're having any issues, email me uh, or just let me know. Okay, all right, thanks.